Hosting major international events, expanding national cycling facilities, promoting cycling for all, Chai Oku has achieved great things for our sport since his election as Korea Cycling Federation President in 2009. Each year, South Korea hosts international cycling events, not least the Tour de Korea, an important fixture on the UCI Asia Tour, which consistently attracts a high-quality peloton. Mr. Koo is also dedicated to the development of young cyclists. In 2014, the UCI Junior Track Cycling World Championships unfolded in the magnificent Guang Mayong Velodrome, while on the road, the Tour de DMZ is the final stopover of the UCI Men Junior Nations Cup. The UCI World Cycling Centre's career satellite opened in 2013 and contributes hugely to the development of cyclists, in particular juniors and women, not only from Korea, but from around the world. The country's expanding cycling facilities include the country's first 250-metre indoor velodrome, which opened in 2017 at the National Training Centre in Jincheon, North Chungcheong Province. BMX tracks have been constructed around the country as Mr. Ku and his federation developed this discipline. In the last three years, the number of BMX riders in the youth category has increased from zero to almost a thousand. 100 new BMX coaches have been trained over the same period. As president of the Korea Cycling Federation, Mr. Koo played a major role in the unification of his federation and the Federation for Cycling for All. This unification was achieved in 2016 and has become a best practice example for all other sports federations. Mr. Koo loves to share his passion for cycling, not least through his bicycle museum, Dubaku, which he established in 2012. With a collection of more than 300 bicycles covering all eras of the sport, the museum has attracted more than 10,000 visitors, including celebrities and professional cyclists. Chai Olku's drive, commitment and professionalism continue to benefit our sport, and we thank him sincerely. <laughs>